And triple digit temperatures valley wide for today. It only gets hotter from here. The good news is it is short lived though, but still going to be a little warm for this time of year once we get past the middle of the week here. But the, uh, the ridge of high pressure that warmed us up today, uh, that's continuing to build over us. But once we get to about Tuesday into Wednesday, it will break down a little bit. Mainly the rest of California will feel that first. We're really not going to feel a big change in our temperatures probably until about Thursday or so. That's where temperatures will finally drop into the 90s, and that ridge moves off to the east little by little each day here. Even though we'll drop into the upper 90s, that's still a little warm for this time of year. And as long as the number of wildfires continue to burn, especially the rough fire in Fresno County, we're going to have some areas of haze to deal with here for a while. So air quality is also a concern. It also creates a report visibility in parts of the east side of the valley into the foothills and the Sierra. Still a little warm out there this evening. 89 degrees here in Fresno, 85 for Sacramento. Still in the 90s for Las Vegas at 95 this evening and 103 in Phoenix. And temperatures in the South Valley this evening, 88 now in Hanford, 84 in Visalia, and we have 78 degrees for Madeira in the North Valley. And we are definitely warmer by several degrees compared to this time yesterday. For most of the valley, it's actually a little bit cooler though this evening in Visalia and Porterville. But last night at this time, we had a little bit of cloud cover down there. So uh, when sky is clear, the evening hours temperature tend to be a little bit cooler, so that's what's going on there. Here are your highs for today. For the second time in August, we hit the triple digits in Fresno, 25th time this year so far. 105 the high for today, same deal for Madera, 104 in Merced and 106 in Hanford, 102 in Visalia. These are not record-breaking temperatures. We're about 10 degrees above average for this time of year, which is 97 degrees. Uh, the record in Fresno today is 110, set back in 1920. Pretty much the entire week here, records are around 110 for this time of year. We'll get a little close, but uh, just not close enough. Air quality, a big concern. It's unhealthy for sensitive groups, though, in Merced, Madera, and Kings County. Unhealthy for everyone in Fresno and Tulare counties for tomorrow. And of course, it is back to school tomorrow. It's going to be awfully hot when kids go back to school about 7 o'clock or so. Mid 70s in the early morning hours, mid 90s at noon. Fresno at 106 for tomorrow. And uh, that's one of the hotter spots for tomorrow. We're looking for 101 in Merced, 106 in Fresno, and 102 in Portoville, and 104 in Madeira. Foothill and Sierra temperatures even hotter compared to the last few days here. 90s for most Sierra communities. Same deal for the foot a couple spots in the triple digits for tomorrow and of course tonight we're going to have a fairly warm evening with overnight lows in the low 70s under mostly clear skies. So tomorrow 106 in Fresno, 104 on Tuesday and then we'll finally start to feel a little bit of a difference by the middle of the week here but still upper 90s for mid-August. That's still a little warm for this time of year but at least uh, the extreme heat is just for one more day than uh, little changes day by day here as we move forward here into the rest of the week.